Hi, I'm Chris Wise with Wise About Flyer Mound, and I'm here with Dr. Matt Brown, and we are at MB Orthodontics, correct? Yes, ma'am. Thank All you. All right, I got it right. <laughs> so we were just talking about his wonderful location. Okay, you can't see it, but I have got the best view in town. It's just so many windows. So he was just telling me about how great this is. So I can imagine as you're a patient and you're sitting here and you're looking out and just seeing you know, greenery and just all that Highland Village has to offer, that that's probably calming. So yeah, what a great that, thing. That's the idea. We had thought about moving um, after five years, but um, we couldn't couldn't give up the, the view. So yeah. uh, we're still here. Yeah, well, that's good. So tell me, I mean, personally, I've had braces three times, once as a 14-year-old, once as a 24-year-old, and once as a 40-year-old. 40, 40 so I've got a lot of history. Yeah. So what's your target client and um anybody that wants to improve their smile okay. and so we see them from uh six or seven years old to up in the 70s oh um, and so um and sometimes it's first timers and sometimes it's people coming back in for a little touch up yeah um but you know teeth shift things happen mm -hmm. and so um anything from just a little bit of shifting to some trauma or stuff like that oh. you know sometimes you gotta come back in that second time so yeah um but yeah, yeah definitely I know about teeth shifting, <laughs> so that's, that was my problem. I think it was kind of grinding. So um, so your location here, so you bought the practice, you said? Yes, ma'am, yeah. So Dr. Paul Lively started this practice uh, okay. back in the 80s, I think. And it, oh, wow. at first it was on the corner, um, just down the street, 407 okay. in uh, Highland Village Road. And then he built this office in 2000, 2001. Okay. Um, I started coming around in the fall of 2014 and bought the practice uh, January of 15. So okay. we're coming up on seven years. Great. Yeah. And so you're talking about expanding even. I mean, that's exciting. Yeah. Um, so we, we've talked about uh, adding a second location mm -hmm. um, a little further west and some, some high growth areas and mm -hmm. stuff. but. Uh, we're we're waiting to see. Yeah, yeah, definitely. You need rooftops and chimneys need, need, before. Need, need rooftops. Yep. Need people. Need teeth. Um, and uh, yeah, still kind of see what. It's just kind of crazy in this post-pandemic or yeah. mm -hmm. waning pandemic exactly. time. On, exactly. Uh, what are interest rates going to do? What are you know home builds remote oh, like this gosh. market? Yeah, you're. Yeah. This market's <laughs> crazy. So. You see, I have gray hair it's for a reason. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, this market is nuts. Yeah, I mean, so it's crazy. just crazy. There might be some opportunities with commercial buildings that are now vacant. Yeah, because so people as people put, are working from home and yeah. um, uh, commercial occupancy goes down and some of those lease rates come down, you know, mm -hmm. it, may, it, it may make sense to, you know, what wasn't making sense in 2019 and then definitely 2020 mm -hmm. may, may make sense here pretty exactly. quick. So. Exactly. So what different, I mean, what different styles of straightening do you do, if that's even a question? Yeah, so uh, clear liners, uh, you know, Invisalign. Okay, uh, that's what I used on my third time because yeah. I was an adult. <laughs> and it's, it's good for, it's good for touch-ups, and then it, it's come a long way. Um, as providers, we've learned a lot more about how to move teeth with aligners than, mm -hmm. um, than we knew when it was kind of a new field yeah. and stuff. Um, and then, uh, but yeah, so we do uh, clear liners, and then as far as braces go, traditional braces, um, we've got metal, clear, gold, um, different. They're all, they all, yeah. So it's an aesthetic choice uh, if you're rocking them. You for, might see Chris Wise with yeah. some gold braces. <laughs> and they're, they're, they're not, they're not like 24 karat well, ones. Yeah. They're kind of rose gold. They, they have some 24 karat oh ones God. and stuff, but yeah, that. we don't need that. Um, but uh, it's an aesthetic choice, and so uh, you're there to please, yeah, right? <laughs> if people want gold, we do gold. If they want, we've got like a rhodium that's kind of a platinum. It's kind of a softer. Okay. Um, and then some some of those work for uh, patients that have nickel allergy um, uh -huh. because your stainless steel brackets have a little bit of nickel in them. Okay. And so um, so some of our nickel sensitive Who patients. Would have thought? Yeah. Oh it, my gosh. There's, yeah. Oh my god! I just different. remember like choosing the the rubber band yeah, color. Yeah, still have the rubber band color. That colors. was my, you know, uh, I was Aggie, so I was maroon and white yeah. when I was in my twenties. So, um, yeah, if you know, and still have the rubber band colors, and then we mm -hmm. have some some patients that don't want any colors, and we either go kind of a neutral color, or we have some self ligating brackets too that that oh. don't don't require the colors. So, oh my god! Yeah, wow, bunch, bunch of different options. It's come a long way. It has come a long way. It is definitely well. Somebody who's like I said. Had them now several times. My son is on his second round. Yeah. My other son got my husband's teeth and they're perfectly straight. There. God did perfect. But there you go. <laughs> on my side, no, not so much. <laughs> so, well, this is great. Yeah. So, I mean, what a great office. So Thank seriously, you. if you're needing orthodontics or your child is suddenly, you know, getting at the point where you have teeth behind teeth and things like that, 
then check out Matt Brown's office because I think just by looking at this, I mean, it's just very nice and clean. He's got Apple products everywhere. I mean, so this is a top-notch dentist or orthodontist. So want to make sure that you get with the right person. And I believe that you would be a very good resource. Thank you, ma'am. I yeah, appreciate that. Definitely. Well, good. Well, thank you so much for tuning in today. And we will see you next time on Wise About Flower Mound. I am Chris Wise. This is Dr. Matt Brown. And we're at MB Orthodontics. Talk to you soon. Thanks.